Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to fix the latest blue screen of death that uh, some people are getting. Uh, it's caused by a game service, a uh, game input service that terminated unexpectedly and you'll get this a couple of times. Um, the hint is actually in the error um, and you'll see here the compound file game input services was produced with a new version of storage. So that tells you something's a little bit fishy. So of course because this is a service uh, the first thing you need to do is you need to go into Windows Services here and in here you will go to uh, go to Game, Input Services and you'll probably see you've got two of them so here you can see I've got two of them running this is obviously the problem so you'll see the one is running in this folder over here uh, sorry actually it's this one over here, Game Input Services uh, these are actually interlinked here, yeah. but you've got game input service here. There it is, the first one. This one is in system 32. And this one over here, that is in Windows program files. So one of these is probably outdated. So the quick fix is, of course, you just go in here and you'll double check. And if you go to your program files, so we'll go to program files. Uh, let's just double check which one it was, x86, go x86, you'll say, there we go, Microsoft Game Input, if I go x64, if you look at the date, you can see this one's outdated, now if we go to Windows, System32, and we go down to Game Input Service, there we go, and you can see this one is new, so this one is the, new, the right one, so now what you need to do is just to, uh, uninstall the the old one so we will go to uh, inst installed apps and here we will type in game input service and there you can see this is the old one so what we will do here you can actually see that this 10.1 actually corresponds with uh, the one over here so if I double click here um, this one is fine but I actually saw it over here this game service Actually, it doesn't, so forget about that. But anyway, we've got two game input services that we need to clear up. So what we need to do is just go in and uninstall this one. So what we'll do here is uninstall. It will then say it's preparing to remove. You let it do its thing. This pop-up, you just say yes. Okay, and now it's uninstalled. So it's gone. Uh, now what we need to do is we need to go in here and we need to check if it's actually inst installed it here. So we will go into x86, game input service is now gone, which is exactly what we wanted. Uh, so let's just start up services again, services. And let's go into game input services here. And you can see we've only got one game input service. So this is exactly what we wanted. And you can therefore just set this one to automatic. So it starts up automatically. And there you go. The problem is then solved. Um, so yeah, that's how you fix it. It's super easy, super simple. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you liked the video and hope it helps you. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye.